2018 Jeep Cherokee Review. The 2018 Jeep Cherokee's weak base engine power and below average cargo volume put it in the bottom 50% of RS. However, it will have some positives, say for example a comfortable ride and admirable off-road abilities. New for 2018 Minor alterations in trim levels Pros and cons Comfortable, upscale cabin Easy Taos infotainment system Remarkable off-road capabilities within this price range Less cargo space than most compact SUVs Underpowered base engine Below average fuel economy On the plus side, the 2018 Jeep Cherokee has superb off-road shops, an easy on-road ride quality and also a competent available V6 engine. However, its standard engine is sluggish, and it is fuel economy ratings are the lowest within the class. The Cherokee standard 2.4-liter four-cylinder engine incorporates a 184 horsepower rating. It takes time just for this engine to obtain the Cherokee in control, partly since this SUV is heavy for the size. The four-cylinder is likely to drone at highway speeds. Jeep also provides a 271 horsepower 3.2-liter V6 engine, which feels considerably more capable for passing and towing. Both are mated to an oven shifting, though sometimes tentative, 9-speed automatic transmission. With either engine, fuel economy is unhealthy. The four-cylinder gets 21 miles per gallon within the city and 30 miles per gallon while traveling. The highway rating drops by 1 mile per gallon for your V6, but since it requires a higher grade of gasoline, annual fuel cost is about $250 higher. To view the high points from the Cherokee's handling, you have to venture dirt. This compact SUV is able to keep up with rugged rivals, along with the Trailhawk Edition has trail ready components for additional grip, including a four-wheel drive system with lower range, an off-road suspension, a rear locking differential, and five terrain modes auto, snow, sport, sand mud, and rock. Travelers will delight in comfortable accommodations within the 2018 Jeep Cherokee. Seats are stylish and nicely cushioned, and except to the base trim, every passenger seat slide, recline, and fold for added comfort and cargo versatility. Cargo capacity is small, however. Jeep's infotainment strategy is easy to use. The Cherokee has five seats and comes standard with cloth upholstery, six-way manual adjustments to the front seats and also a 60-40 split folding rear seat. Upgraded upholstery carries a mix of cloth, leather, and vinyl, along with Napa leather. Power adjustable front seats, heated and ventilated front seats, a fold flat front passenger seat, a leather wrap tire, as well as a heated tire are also available. Both the top and rear seating areas are comfy enough for the full day of driving. The second row seats slide and recline, and you will adjust those to create more leg room for backseat passengers or even expand the cargo area. For child safety seats, there's two full groups of lower anchors inside the back seat, and also a third anchor for your middle seat. To install an auto seat here, you will have to borrow one anchor in the adjacent seat. The Cherokee's lower anchors are super easy to find and employ. Three tether anchors are also within the back seat, two of which can be tricky to differentiate from other hardware. The standard infotainment system inside the Cherokee is made of Jeep's Uconnect infotainment interface, a 5-inch touchscreen display screen, a 6-speaker speakers, Bluetooth, and also a USB port. A rear-view camera parking sensors, and keyless entry will also be included. The Cherokee's highly praised infotainment product is straightforward and to learn, 
as well as the upgraded strategy is even better. It features an 8.4-inch touchscreen display, a customizable menu bar, satellite radio, as well as a Wi-Fi spot. Other interior options with the Cherokee include aircon, dual-zone automatic climate control, a dual-pane panoramic sunroof, a 9-speaker Alpine premium stereo audio, navigation, an invisible charging pad, a proximity key, and push-button start. The Cherokee has 24.6 cubic feet of cargo room behind the spine seat and 54.9 cubic feet total once you lay down the 60-40 split folding rear seats. Both of these measurements are saved to the low side for just a compact SUV. For most trim levels above the bed's base, the leading passenger seat can fold flat, and that is helpful for hauling long items. A power lift gate is accessible.